guys, welcome back to Noraverse, where we are going to continue the fabulous story that is three times you. And as you can see, I have my little cinnamon roll, Lord Brian over here. He is sleeping and I am not going to bother him because that's just cruel. And that is just horrible. And once you see a cute little cat sleep, you just can't bear the consequence of waking him up and just him being all like yawning and sad and being like, why you wake me up? You know, he's right here. We can stare at him. He's adorable eye candy as usual. Anyway, so I am so excited to continue this story because the cliffhangers are insane. And I'm so grateful for you guys for continuing to watch the story with me and progressing through every single chapter and giving me new recommendations because you guys know these things well some of these stories better than I do and I like your thoughts and recommendations and your opinions so I finally got my hair done this lighting is really bad but it's actually really well done I'm really happy and I feel new again and I got my nails done it's just ugh feels great so I'm finally put together and I can continue filming for you guys this is going to be a crazy busy summer but I am going to try my best to be as consistent as possible and hopefully post every day or every other day I know I miss some days but that is literally when I have absolutely no choice but and I cannot post so without further ado this is three times you chapter 23 and give this video a like this is Lord Byron's Instagram my Instagram our TikTok and let's go morning what are you doing banging my head against a wall oh yeah that happened last time we're rehashing it a bit i can see that why i'm helping someone that's a good thing no you already have a spot in heaven there's no need to try too hard i should keep my distance hey are you sick come on let me see are you sick i think i am sick in love whatever i need coffee then we can talk i'm with you girl i cannot do anything without coffee I couldn't sleep last night. What did you do then? I watched him, held his hand when he flinched. I even gave him the whole duvet. Did you sleep with someone? Was there someone here in our apartment last night? No, I mean, I watched someone sleep the whole night, like on Zoom, FaceTime. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. I pretended to be asleep when he left. He kissed my forehead. Who would fall asleep next to a girl like you? Who? I am going to end him. I'm such an idiot. Hey, where are you going? Wait, what was that? Interesting. Oh gosh, I put salt in my coffee again. Why do I keep drinking it? Ugh. What swimsuit do I want to wear? Swift floral, red cherry, summer cocktail. Oh, I like that. Let's just go with that. It's beautiful and classy. Oh, it's Axel. What's up, doll? I can't swim. Wait, didn't she get taught by Vaughn? Why not? Whatever. Come on, I'll teach you. Uh-oh. Do you have a death wish mate? What? She doesn't know how to swim. Why are your ears red? Hmm? Hot in here, no? <laughs> Wait, does Axel have a little crush on moi? It is kind of chilly. Oh, you forker. What? I just imagined Nova in a swimsuit. Not a big deal. There's something quite hot under that bathing suit. One, two, and punch. <laughs> I could have told you that too. Me and Nova are on the same page. What the heck, man? Fork you. Come, Nova. Actually, Axel's teaching me how to swim. You owe me some swimming lessons. Oh, maybe she didn't learn. You know what? His punishment for ignoring me is going to be Axel teaching me how to swim. There you go. Revenge is a dish served cold. No. It goes, revenge is a dish best served cold. There you go. What about swimming lessons, Axel? Make his punches worth the pain? You bet. Nova, I've got no more patience where he is concerned. Just go, I have plenty of patience. Oh my god. No freaking way, go and change. What are you, my dad? Forking hell, I was right, she is so bloody hot. I will knock you clear out when we get out of here. <laughs> okay, well like, don't stop on my account. Turn around, Nova. <laughs> okay. Uh-oh. Shut up, cause I will knock you block off. Date her or let me do it. I will mess you up. Wait, what is it with like Shirley's best friends and all of them falling in love with their girls, right? That's been the pattern. Mark of my words. <laughs> Hilarious. Where were we? Touch her and I'll kick the guts out of you. I don't think your threats work anymore. Bring it on me. Why are you teasing him? He drives me crazy with his appetite for fighting. High five. Yeah. Axel. I guess I've warmed up a little. Now do me a favor and never visit my battle room or else. Oh, fine. Oh my God, this was revenge for him coming to the fighting ring. Oh my God, this is amazing. Such a good friend. Yay. Fine. Fine, yes. Guess he likes you more than fighting. Finally. Um, he's totally cheating, that's why. What? I said nothing. Haha, <laughs> almost broke your own rules. Idiot. What's going on? Nothing. Why are your cheeks pink? Yeah, Nova, why are your cheeks pink? Hmm? Ugh, ew, losers. Okay, wait, is Axel really teaching us how to swim? Um, oh my god, oh my god, whoopsie. <laughs> Ugh, you're so rude and I'm like coughing, choking here, drowning. Yay, 
we got a life preserver. Nice. Woohoo. What is she? What is he recording us for a TikTok or something? Ah, gosh, he scared me. What time is it? Um, 10 p.m. Why? Oh, are we waiting for Vaughn? Where are you going? To buy some popcorn. Wanna come with me? No. Now we are going to watch our K drama tonight. Duh. Go buy popcorn. I need to, um, uh, shower? I will shower until you come back. Just showered a few minutes ago. Oh, well, I forgot to wash my hair. Like, greasy hair grows. You're acting odd. Hurry up. I need to know what happens next. Same. I love Lee too much. I need to see his sparkling eyes one more time. <laughs> Totally. I hate lying to my BFF. In that sense, I committed a crime. Oh, Vaughn Shirley, you are trouble. He definitely is. Uh-oh. Now, something is off about her. Why is she acting strange? Fork, she almost saw me. Shh. Stay here, do not make a sound, and do not move. Okay? Turn off your phone. Where are you going? And don't ask me questions. Okay. Wow, he just loves us too much. Poor baby fell asleep without us. Later on. <gasps> What's wrong? <laughs> what happened? Where does it hurt? What's the matter? He died. What? Who? Who died? No, what happened? I can't stop crying. My heart hurts. Tell me who died. Lee, he died in the water with his mermaid and the episode ended. What do I do? You've got to be kidding me. I can't stop crying. My poor Lee. Oh no. Unbelievable. What are you doing? What am I supposed to do? Hug me, tell me a joke, give me some tissues, hug me. Um, when a person cries, you give a hug out of humanity. What about me? I almost had a heart attack because of a freaking actor, Lee. I never saw you crying like that. I thought something happened. Oh, well, I cried even worse before and we both know why. Oh, come here. Oh, that must have touched the heartstrings right there. Leave me alone. Oh, this is heartbreaking, you guys. One more. I think you had enough today. How funny is this? You're supposed to serve a customer. That is your job. Uh-oh, everyone's recording her. Drama. I have no problem doing so, but look around. The pub is full of reporters, and I'm pretty sure it's not me they want to photograph. Give me another one. As you wish, my job is to serve customers anyway. Exactly. If those reporters publish pictures of her, then all her work goes down the drain. Her career goes down the toilet as I pour this drink. I'll be out of town for the weekend. Where are you going? When are you coming back? I'm gonna say, where are you going? Cause I'm curious. Where are you going? My dad and I have some business to take care of in Manchester. Come with us? Nope, I have lots of drawings to finish and I need to finish my essay on Monday. Hmm. I'll not fight, I promise. Are you sure? Don't make promises you can't keep. Derek stole money from us and killed five of our drivers. Oh Lord. Until we get him, you must be careful, Nova. Don't go alone outside, especially at night. I thought his business with me was over. True, but he might try to get you to hurt me. He broke our deal, baby. Why doesn't he give up? He wants something. What? He's after power, status, and more money. Why? He knows things he shouldn't have. Once all of this is over, I'll tell you everything about me. You don't have to tell me anything. Just be careful. It's not me, I care about all that matters is you you need to put yourself first no matter what even if something happens to me you need to keep on with your life Vaughn. okay you can't blame yourself for other people if something happens to me will you happily continue your life yes you should do the same nothing's going to happen to you promise me Vaughn. promise me no matter what you will stop blaming yourself it sounds like she's about to off herself is it just me just me no I wake up alone. Even if Vaughn goes to Manchester with his dad, I still feel uneasy. What if something happens to him? Stop that, Nova. If Kian is there, nothing can happen to him. But what if? What if he can't sleep at night? What if he fights again? I'm gonna say, what if he fights again? Huh? What on earth is wrong with me? Vaughn can take care of himself. I thought my feelings for him are gone, but deep down I know I still love him and I can't stop worrying about him. Girl, like, are you delusional? Obviously your feelings for him are not gone and not even deep down, like, up there on the shallow surface they are there prevalent as ever saturday night mm -hmm. what about this is she going on a date mm, you look lovely she looks sassy yes queen you look like a goddess mm, of course what are you wearing i still don't think it's a good idea to go clubbing tonight uh oh i sense something bad is gonna happen why not everyone goes out saturday night stop acting like a grandma okay but no long ago i had a stalker on my back what if he follows me from afar exactly why we go to places where it's crowded stop thinking too hard okay if i stay home i will think about Vaughn and die of rage because he did not call me at least once. Ooh, jerk. I need a distraction. Fine, let me change. <sighs> What do I want to wear? Elegantly and stylishly fashionable golden hot summer vibes. Let's see. Ooh, that is beautiful. Yes, I'm feeling that. Let's see. <gasps> yeah, that is so much more her. And mm, that's also her. I mean, it's super cute. I don't like the shoes with that, though. I like the gold. Let's do that. I'm going to like her hoops. I need to get some hoops. I can't find my gold hoops anywhere. It is perfect. Shut the front door. <laughs> I know. I put myself together quite well. 
We're dancing. We're at a club. There's music. Someone's singing. I wonder if we have any bodyguards on us. I feel like Vaughn would give us some. <gasps> wow. I know, right? Dance, dance, dance. Have a drink. I'm gonna dance. Let's dance. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Uh oh. Man. Who is she? Holy fork. Uh oh. Axel's here. He can protect us at least. <laughs> I know, man. Confidence is a sassy quality in a woman. Her outfit does attract me and her smile is killing me. Okay, what about Kate? What is she chopped liver? She's also beautiful. She's Shirley's girl. No. What on earth is she doing here? I can compete with any man, but not with Shirley. At least you're smart. Do you know how to make Shirley go mad? How? Watch. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, this is gonna be good. <gasps> the fuck is she doing there? No idea, but she is H-O-T. What is she thinking? A club is a perfect place where Derek can get to her. Watch her until I get there. If something happens to Noah, I will bring the whole club down with you inside. And that is how you get a man to come after you. Um, he is pissed off big time. I messed up. I regret sending him the picture. <laughs> I'd react the same way if my dropped dead gorgeous girl went clubbing without me dressed to kill. Fork, what was I thinking? Now I have to babysit them the whole night. At least Axel and Kate can flirt. Come on, come on, pick up the goddamn phone. Ugh, what's wrong, son? I have to go, Dad. What? Where? Back to London. Are you losing your mind? If you walk away right now, you're throwing away millions and losing our one big shot to make Derek forfeit the last drop of power he has left. Postpone it, I have to go. Oh. Vaughn! How can I let him take over my business when he bails on me in the middle of closing an important deal? Well, maybe you should let him get married to me first and then take over the business. Look who's here. <gasps> did she steal your man? She did. You thinking what I'm thinking? <laughs> oh, that's Derek. Hello, beautiful. I'm not interested, sorry. You heard her. Leave. Oh, no bad intentions. I'm the owner of this club. It's my duty to make sure you two are having a fabulous time tonight. I must say your beauty does not go unnoticed. Thanks for stopping by, but we are good. Can I at least offer you two a drink? Oh my god, guys, we are literally in the lion's den. Like, Derek is there, Zara is there, at least we have our boy Axel there, and our man, main man, Squeeze, Vaughn is on his way. So this is going to be a crazy next chapter. Anyway, let me know your thoughts on what you think is going to happen. Do you think there's going to be some sort of drama before Vaughn gets there, or he's going to come and start a fight with Derek? I don't know, so many theories. But yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Give this video a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will see you guys later.